Hey what's up everyone and welcome to Daily Code Buffer. Thank you so much everyone for giving me so much love and support throughout this journey. Since past few months we have been working on a course and you all guys have enrolled in that course and you guys are giving a tremendous support on that course. And yes, I am working on a new course as well. I will announce that very soon, but for this particular course that is microservices with spring boot that is a so much love and support from you guys there is a lot of good feedback and a lot of reviews as well and that gives us a motivation for me to create more such courses and more such youtube videos for you guys now due to this tremendous support i am obliged to give you back as well so for this particular course that is microservices with spring boot i am giving a huge discount of 90% for all of you first 1000 learners would be able to take part on this discount that is huge 90% you can use dcb90 code to avail this discount now what is included in this course you may ask there are a lot of things that is included in this course you are going to learn the basics of spring and spring boot how you are going to create the apis and then you are going to learn how to connect your applications to database using gpa okay so you are going to learn all those steps as well so you are going to learn from basics to creating the application that connects to your database and perform all the operations then you are going to convert your entire applications to the microservices architecture where you will learn all the different concepts about the microservices where you will learn how you can divide your microservices and how you can design your microservices architecture how are the different components and what are the different components involved in your microservices architecture what is service registry how you can connect your applications to service registry what is spring cloud what are the different components of spring cloud that is uh, what is api gateway what is cloud gateway how to configure your config servers and all those stuffs as well you are also going to convert your application into containerized form so you are going to learn the docker as well and also you are going to secure your application using spring security and for that we are also going to use the octa authentication so you are going to authenticate and authorize all your requests using octa to make sure your microservices is secure and after containerizing you are also going to publish your application deploy your applications to the kubernetes cluster so you are going to also learn about what is kubernetes all the basic components how you can make sure your applications are kubernetes ready and you can deploy your applications to kubernetes clusters you are going to not just learn these things but you are also going to learn cloud as well so you are going to learn the basics of cloud and how you can deploy your applications to the cloud platform as well so that is also you are going to learn alongside you are also going to learn how to have the automated pipelines for all this ci cd so you are going to learn continuous integration continuous delivery and to create a complete pipeline where from development to deployment you are going to automate each and everything so that is also we are going to learn alongside we will also learn the resiliency in our system so we will make sure that our application whatever that we have developed is resilient enough to make sure all the requests are fulfilled successfully so for that we are going to learn about the rate limiters circuit breakers and all those different components as well so you can see that we are going to do a lot of things in this course plus there is a new section that i have added is regarding the spring boot 3 and java 17 upgrade so with this course there is a free section extra added that is the upgradation of your microservices to spring boot 3 currently we have developed the entire application using spring 2.7 and java 11 but you should also learn how to upgrade your applications as well so whenever you are working in your applications and project this is the steps that you have to do in your application so this is the part that we have added so that you can learn more about that as well so you can see that there are a lot of different components and things involved within this course so i hope you will enjoy this course as well there is a one bonus thing as well so whoever is going to register for this course will also get a free access to the same course on udemy as well so i have published the same course on udemy as well because there were a lot of requests from you guys so that you want the same course on udemy as well to make sure that you have the same platform for all your different courses as well so that's why i have uploaded the same course on udemy as well so by registering to this course uh, on the link that i have mentioned below you will get the access to the course on udemy as well how to get the access to the udemy course you will get each and everything once you register to this course so this is what it is happening you will get a course on very affordable rate so anyone would be able to enroll on this course and learn the 
new concepts about the microservices and Spring Boot. The idea behind is that maximum learners should be able to enroll on this course and should be able to grab this opportunity. So don't forget to use the coupon code DCB90 and the link for everything is given in the description below. So grab this opportunity and don't miss out on this. If you have any doubts regarding any of the things, then do let me know in the comment section below. So with this message, I welcome you each and every one on the course. We are going to learn a lot of things in this course and I hope you enjoy this course as well. Also tell me in the comment section below what are the course you want me to create for you guys. So that's been it in this video. I will see you in the next video. Till then, happy coding. Bye bye.